lot of snowboarders want to know how to get better. We're going to show you how by learning from the pros who push the sport to the limit. Most of what is out there right now is about how to do tricks, which is why a lot of snowboarders have trouble making turns. We want to help everyone turn better and enjoy the whole mountain, not just the rail park. So how can you ride better? Start with the simple fundamentals of balance and build from there. Let's talk about your hands. One of the most important lessons I've ever learned from a coach is to put my front hand over the nose of my board, period. Nothing else. Just take my hand and park it there all the time, no matter what I am doing. Sounds simple, right? It is, but the hard part is sticking to it when you're going fast and rolling over on the edge and you want to reach down for the snow. You have to trust your balance. Here is some video of pro snowboard racers using their front hand while racing at top speed. Watch their hand as they go through the turn. And then here's my daughter, yeah. who's six years old using her front hand. Hand over the nose, there you go. Here's Katie Tazuki using it in the half pipe. Fastest of the day. Here's Evan Strong, Paralympic gold medalist, using it while racing board across. And here are some recreational free carvers using it. And here's what happens when your hand is not over the notes. Watch as the weight shifts away from the board and into the snow. Now what about your backhand, you may be wondering. Try not to rotate it, and if possible, keep it over the tail or your back foot. But the backhand will follow the front hand, so work on the front hand first. Using your hand to guide your board is simple and it works. But the simple stuff is oftentimes the hardest. It will take a while of thinking about it before it becomes automatic. Keep thinking. Hand over the nose. Hand over the nose. Hand over the nose. Now get out there and ride.